everyone. This is Tebo Homakwani, also known as Miss T. Welcome to Moments of Reflection with Miss T on MCI TV. Uh, like we said, this is a show that talks about everything that happened at the Young Women's Camp 2020. We are doing life after the camp. Uh, at the camp, we had a topic which we were talking about, and one of the major topic was birthing your godly purpose. With me today, I have Miranda. Mabuhwani, and she'll be talking to us about what finding your godly purpose means. Evangelist Miranda, welcome to Moments of Reflection with Miss T. Miss T, thank you so much for having me. What a pleasure to be here. Uh, Evangelist, in your own words, would you just tell us who is Miranda? Well, Miranda is a mother of one, a wife, married to Pastor Stevens Mabuhwani but also a pastor, a life coach, a chef. <laughs> so I'm, I'm a woman of many, many heads, but a woman that is very p passionate about people developing and people getting to know what their purpose is, yeah. giving birth to who they are predestined to be. Because I believe that um, with each and every one of us, we are born for a time, for a season, for a purpose and we ought not to go back having not attained it sure you said a mouthful and with saying that you are passionate about people birthing your, their godly purpose would you just explain to us uh, when you think about the word finding your godly purpose what comes to mind what comes to mind for me is ordination mm. what comes to mind for me is predestination okay. because i truly believe that each and every one of us and that is what the word says in jeremiah 1 that i foreknew you and i therefore predestined you god has got a set destination for us so for us to find our godly purpose we ought to go back there and say all right lord when you created me, mm. what was that final moment of destiny that I ought to attain? And until we go back there, we are just people that are living um, directionless, even motionless, if you mm. like. We're just going about like scatterheads and not really working towards what God has created us for. And the danger with that, Miss mm. T., is the word of God says we are created by the word. Sure. Okay. We are created as the word. And then the word says the word of God shall not return back to God having not attained mm. or fulfilled the purpose for which it has been sent for. So the danger is you are delaying your own going back wow sure sure yeah you are delaying your own going back so as i'm hearing you and uh, talking about us being created by the word so that means that uh, finding your godly purpose goes hand in hand with the word of god meaning the bible and how do you connect the bible to purpose how can a person say okay by reading the bible i'm able to find my godly purpose miss t now you must remember that the word is twofold. Mm. You've got the written word, okay. which is the Bible. Yeah. Then you've got the logos, which is the spoken word. Mm. These two things are critical. Okay. In the Bible, we find guidelines mm. as to how we make or bring to reality what the spoken word about you is mm -hmm. without the logos without the written word mm. you cannot make it you need both of them okay you need to know what has been said mm. what has been declared about me and then after go back and say what has then been written mm. not only about me but about how to go about yes. The written word gives manifestation to the spoken sure. word. Yeah, that is very powerful. The written word gives manifestation to the spoken word. Yeah. Yeah. So uh, a lot of people right now, uh, especially in our generation, 
uh, always talking about purpose and I think that is why I wanted us to uh, extinguish the difference between purpose the worldly purpose and the finding your godly purpose why is it important for a person to say okay there is purpose and I have a purpose in life but there is a godly purpose which I need to find why is it important for us as humans to know the purpose of God about our lives because like we said previously you are created mm. out of the word you are created from a particular place sure your mom and dad were used as vehicles sure. on earth mm. but really your existence has got nothing to do with them mm. they were just vehicles so it is important for us to then say go back to the maker yeah. go back to the one that has the thoughts and the word of god says for I know, Jeremiah 29, 11, mm -hmm. well known, for I know, yes. I mm -hmm. know, I know. Who is the I? Mm -hmm. The I is the I am. It yes. is God himself. He is the creator. So I know the plans that I have for you. Plans to prosper you. Plans to give you a future. Plans to give you a hope. And plans not to bring you harm. So that is the one that you first thing that you need to understand that yes I am in this earth mm. yes I have been given birth through human vessels mm. earthen vessels but I am not of this world yes. so that's the very important mm. secondly is understanding now also that I am now in this earth I live in this earth i ought to prosper in this earth then there are vehicles that are provided for us to be able to fulfill mm. that which was written mm. about us and so we ought not to make a mistake of mixing the two often what we want to do as human beings mm. is we want to follow the patterns and the systems and our own desires because wow miss t is doing um mci tv she's presenting this is something that i desire yeah. i then follow what miss t is doing mm. but what i'm missing out of there is perhaps miss t if she has found how godly yeah purpose sure. what she was predestined mm. to do then she is walking in authority she's walking in favor mm. if you do not walk in purpose authority and favor then you need to check yourself because you will not prosper mm. you will make it you will make it like everybody else mm. you will get along mm. but purpose brings you to authority to favor it brings you to grace mm. it brings you to a point of success even where you are not qualified you see mm. godly purpose Ms. Sure. T, yes. is way above what you are naturally qualified mm. for but it is what has been birthed yes. intricately knit within you to say you must, you will, whether resources are there, you will. Whether you've got the paper for it or not, you will. But when we follow our own patterns, we then need earthly qualifications. Yes. And when you don't have the earthly qualifications, then you do not make it. Because the earthen doors require an earthen certificate yes. an earthen qualification but when favor authority and grace goes ahead of you it opens doors that would otherwise not be open sure wow so your godly purpose breaks all protocols it breaks <laughs> all protocols that is so amazing so on the 21st of august uh, we will be having women gathered around to find their godly purpose in a nutshell, what would you tell them or what would you say to them that would make them look forward to that day? 
Wow. <laughs> You've got to be there. Yeah. To be honest with you, if you are interested in growing, mm. sure. if you are interested in mm. experiencing change in your life, be it finding yourself, finding your purpose, um, direction in your marriage. Maybe you are divorced. Yeah. You're going through a rough patch. Maybe you just need to be encouraged. Mm. You have got to be there mm. because we are trusting God and we are believing God that this is a God-given moment. Yes. This is a Kairos moment mm. that will bring about change in each and everyone's attendees. Ladies, you don't want to miss out on what will be happening there. Uh, as a as a mother and as an yes. overseer, personally, I'm so grateful for the vision that God has given you, Miss T. I, I, I believe that you have heard God about the season. You've heard God about this time. And I'm trusting that he is not a man to lie. I'm trusting and I know mm -hmm. that he's not a son of man to repent. Yes. He is going to to, to change lives. Mm. He is going to accomplish what he set out to accomplish. Bona, D21, Bona, D21, August. Mm. It is a day of divine appointment. Sure. D21, it's August. Yes. D21, it's August. It's that tendons are going to be touched. Sure. Your life will never be the same again. Meet with us. We are very excited. Sure. If that doesn't make you excited, then I don't know what else you need. <laughs> Evangelist, um, yo, I, I'm so encouraged and I just feel like Gary, Gary Lady 21 tomorrow. I feel you, you know, girl. like I feel really you. full, but yeah, I'm so grateful for God for what He has laid in your heart and especially about finding your godly purpose and purpose being one of the passionate things that you speak about because I believe that in times like this, especially in what we call the new times and the new days that we're living in, it's easy for us to forget the mandate that God has for our lives because we're trying to run after other things. So I know and I believe that on the 21st of August, the women's lives will never be the same again. So mm -hmm. tell, just say your last words to everyone who's watching uh, and encourage them in this season that we are in. In these times that we are living in, COVID times, mm. may I just say to you, you will not die Amen. until your time has come. Ish. The word of God says when David had done all that he needed to do, he rested. <laughs> so for as long as your purpose is not done, your godly mandate not fulfilled, Fear not, you will not die. In the words of one of the fathers of faith in South Africa, Apostle Ralekholela, Retopela, mm. you will live to testify of the goodness of the Lord in the land of the living. Sure. Retopela. Amen. Thank you so much, Evangelist Miranda Mabuhani. It was so nice having you in this episode of Moment of Reflection with Miss T on MCI TV. And I believe that God is about to do great things in Amen. your life. And I know that there's still more that he has in store for you. Amen. So I, I just want to be in the front seat and see Amen. everything that God is about to do. Amen. Thank you so much for being with us today. Remember to always watch Moments of Reflection with Miss T every Wednesday, 6 p.m. on NCI TV. From your girl, Miss T, this is goodbye.